Hey everybody, Ricky here with CTS Gym. Welcome back to Eat Clean Friday. And today we're making something special in the Cortese kitchen. As much as I would like to call this a snack, it's more like dessert because it tastes so good. One of mine and my husband's favorites to nibble on. So let's get started. It's called um, almond butter bark. Just a few ingredients, sim super, super simple. Okay, so we're gonna start with one cup of almond butter. And just for the sake of trying to keep this short, it's not gonna be perfect, but you'll get the idea. One cup almond butter. Then we're gonna do three tablespoons of coconut oil. And make sure there's a trick that I've realized as I've made this a handful of times. Try to keep these at room temperature when you go to make them because you don't want your coconut oil to be clumpy. You want it to be pretty creamy and smooth. Okay. Then we're gonna do a tablespoon and a half of 100% pure maple syrup. Oh my gosh, my mouth is watering and just making this. Okay, and you can see what all the ingredients that we use here. We're going to do one teaspoon, to be careful, of pure vanilla extract, a half a teaspoon of salt, and really that's it, all the ingredients that you need. So we're going to blend this up. pour it in this pan. Now you want to do like an eight by eight pan. I don't have parchment paper and I think that's better to use. So I just sprayed a little bit of coconut spray on the bottom so it doesn't really stick to the pan. But after we get done mixing this up and I make a mess in the kitchen, so pardon me because it gets crazy in this kitchen. I'm gonna mix it up really good. It's nice and creamy, not clumpy again. Pour it right in the pan, spread it out evenly. And if you have a sweet tooth at night, after dinner, nibble on this. It's super rich. You don't need to eat a whole lot of it. And the kids will absolutely love it. If you have kids at home, so we're gonna even this out. This shouldn't be, you know, too thick. And then we top it with, I call them little sun drops. These are my favorite. Instead of M&Ms, you can use M&Ms if you want, but I try to have foods minimally processed and this is like the purest sort of M&Ms that I found. So, super tasty. Tastes just like it. Just a little bit healthier. Much healthier alternative, this sort of snack or dessert than grabbing a Snickers bar or something. So we're gonna just keep layering. Once you're done layering, then we're gonna stick this straight into the freezer. You wanna let it uh, stay in the freezer for about two hours, I would say. And then once it's all done, you break it apart into what looks like bark. So here's your almond butter bark and it's so good. So I hope you enjoy. Like, comment, share with your friends. Let us know how you like it. Hope to hear from you guys. Thanks.